We're in southern New South Wales, so we're down near the Murray, the Albury and Wagga, and halfway between Melbourne and Sydney. It's a beautiful, healthy area. The Riverina varies from the Snowy Mountains, which is snow-capped mountains, to flat plains. So we're on the foothills of the ranges. The rainfall from the ranges come down, and we've still got a relatively mild climate. We don't get extremes, and that's why cattle do so well here. It's God's country. Generally, we receive the rain when we want it. So we get the good rains in the start of autumn, and it'll rain right through, but it's safe country and generally it's perfect for grazing. That's what it's good for, grass, growing grass. It's very sweet, nutritious, and that contributes to the flavour of the beef. It's all about paddock to plate. They want to know the story. They want to know how it's been reared, what it's been fed, from an animal health point of view, from an animal welfare point of view. So. Being part of this EU product, you know that everything is being ticked off. We've done absolutely everything we can to make sure it's a good, healthy eating experience. I get up every morning, put my boots on to go out, check the livestock, make sure they're right. Um, I'll probably feed them before I feed myself. It's what you do. The kids, they love it as well. And they get involved, they open the gates, they don't open the gates sometimes, that's part of it. But yeah, it's a family tradition. Every decision I will ask Anna, I'll run it past Anna about genetics, animal health, whatever. We're always, it's a unit. And we're always bouncing ideas. We do this, we do that, we change this, we change that. And I'll use other sources like my father to run a few ideas past, because he's been there, done that. He knows what it's all about. Hopefully one of our kids will take it on as well. Um, you can't help it. Once it's in your blood, you can't get rid of it. They're, all, they're healthy and they're, you know, they're ready to go and feed, so yeah. that's, that's... One of the other good things about it is the security of where our steers are going, our cattle. Because we do a contract with JBS, we know that um, we have a guarantee of product, and we've got to guarantee that product or it's not accepted. So we're going to make sure everything is right. That steer has lived life to the fullest, from when he's on his mother, to when he was growing in grass around the paddock, to when he was trucked, to when he was grain finished in the feedlot. And we let Riverina grain finish it to the end product. If I do everything from my end, they'll do their end, and that'll give you a good product. And that's what it's all about. Security to make sure that I'm right, JBS is right, and you're right eating the steak. We're all joint partners in this. Our aim is to produce good beef for generations to come. We can't shortchange anything or it's not going to work. We've got to make sure that your kids, kids, eat this product. So we're here to make sure it's right. On a Sunday morning when you're sleeping in bed, we're up there in the morning checking the cows just to make sure they're right. It's what we do.